You're watching FloridaDay.net, and I'm Kemp Parr. We're at Surfaces 2015, and I'm in what some would consider the anchor space on the second floor of the show. I'm in the Mannington space, and I'm with Ed Duncan, the president, and Joe Amata, the vice president of residential styling. Guys, you doing okay? Doing great, Kemp. Yeah. Great Joe? start to the show. Thank you, Kemp. Good to be with you. A very impressive as always. You know, most people know that Mannington is in every surface category. And, uh, you know, from an LVT perspective, that's the big news this year. Uh, you're way, way out front because you've got Made in the USA. You've got a plant in Madison, Georgia that's up and running. I think you're on your third phase of, of expansion. Uh, so let me just start out, Ed, by just asking you a little bit about how you ended 14 and uh, talk a little bit about what's going on with the company. Well, we ended up uh, 14. 14, uh, you know, I think 14 generally everybody in the industry was uh, maybe a little bit uh, less robust than uh, than what uh, we all expected coming into the year. Uh, but we ended up having a good year and uh, we came, we come into this year very excited about what's going on. You know, going back uh, a little over a year ago, in fact, it was October of 2013, we broke ground on our uh, new plant and expansion down in uh, Madison, Georgia for LVT. And uh, this past October, we cut the ribbon and started uh, the uh, the new plant up. And uh, we are uh, we're very excited about you know, what's going on there. Everything that you're standing on here in the booth in LVT, all of our panels, all of our new introductions in LVT are made here in the United States. And uh, so we're very proud of that and uh, very proud to be kind of out in front of the uh, the curve a bit on, uh, on our uh, production and, and our uh, capacity here in the U.S. Mm -hmm. When you start looking, like I said earlier, you're in every surface type, you start looking at how that all balances out. I mean, this is the one that's got the most attention right now, doesn't it? Well, it is. It's kind of the darling of the industry right now, and it's the the category that's uh, grown the uh, the fastest for a lot of reasons. Uh, you know, inherently, it's just a, it's a great product, and uh, there's a lot of competition that's coming in. Uh, but we welcome that. And we've been in the in the flooring business uh, 99 years, and uh, and uh, so we enjoy competition. It makes us better, and uh, so. Uh, but this is a category that that's going to be hot for quite some time, and uh, we, we think we think it's a it's a category that allows us to do the things that we do great at Mannington, which is uh, style really good looking products, uh, produce products that are really great performing on the floor, and uh, it really kind of it's a kind of the perfect sweet spot for us as a company and what our core competencies are. So it's 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 a lot of fun. So before we move to Joe for a little bit more details on product, just talk to me a little bit about your vision for 2015. Uh, I mean, you know, granted the economies all over the rest of the world are a little soft, but uh, it looks like it might be a good year for us in, in uh, the U.S., huh? Well, I, it, you know, to start out with, uh, for one, we don't have the, uh, the horrible winter, at least not so far, that we had uh, last year. And uh, the winter last year, uh, you know, certainly got the, the uh, year off to a, uh, to a tough start. And I don't think that we really ever recovered from that, the industry in general. Uh, it, it looks like, uh, knock on wood, that uh, uh, traffic was a, a bit better, uh, consumer traffic was a bit better in, um, uh, at retail in, in December than what expect, you know, December's always a slow month, but retailers are telling us that, that business was a bit better and uh, that also uh, that January starting out a bit better. So I think there's a little bit uh, more optimism than I had, but I think it's fairly well grounded because I think, you know, I think everybody, uh, you know, you know, came off an okay year. Uh, and, uh, and I think that I, I, we expect that there'll be uh, a, that 15 will be a bit of a better year than 14. We're not looking for massive kind of an improvement over over 14, but we think it'll be it will be better. Yeah. Well, I hope so. I, I, I'm agreeing with you. I think housing might have might actually show up this year. I, we hope so. We hope so. Yeah. Joe, tell us a little bit about what's going on. I mean, you, you are a fantastic designer, and uh, you, I, fortunately they'll be able to show on video uh, what you're doing. Tell us a little bit about what's new this year and what your, uh, what your customers are most excited about. Well, thanks, Kemp. I, first of all, we have a great design team here, and we work great with Ed's group in, in marketing and sales, so it's uh, definitely a team effort. Uh, you know, really it just starts with the home fashion trends. If you need to be in line with what's happening in the home today, because that's how the consumer starts the process. Uh, so it's design trends, it's color trends. You know, some trends are established, so we continue to build upon those trends. You know, the reclaim, the rustic looks in, in design, uh, the grays and the warm dark browns in color, just for an example. Uh, and then the, we look at new trends, what's coming down the road. 
Uh, and some perfect example is that we design for five product categories, as you mentioned. So, you know, the things that we develop in real wood and real porcelain can easily be translated and moved into the imitated categories like laminate, LVT, and sheet vinyl. And so some of the highlights you're going to see this year is you're going to see planks with multicolors within the plank. So it almost looks like there's three colors within the same SKU, which real is really exciting. You're going to see abstract in planks, in porcelain. You're going to see restoration with wider formats, more detail, embossing, color, graining. Uh, and there's a great new product in our wood category called Bercata where it's a new antiquing staining process. It's really bringing out the character. So we can collaboratively put all of our categories together, bring all the trends together, and I think come out with a great collection in each category by itself or as a whole really makes sense in terms of home fashion. Joe, you know, we're standing right in front of a piece of LVT here, and if you hadn't told me it was LVT, I wouldn't know it. It's amazing, the, the stressing and the texture you have in this thing. Yeah. Uh, I mean, LVT has moved to another level, hasn't it? Yeah, and you know what's exciting is that now that we're making it in the United States, we have a greater opportunity to create innovation, create detail, and really hone in on style and do it a lot faster being made here in the United States. Yeah. Congratulations on some gorgeous looking products. Again, we've been talking to Joe Amato, Vice President of Design and Residential, and Ed Duncan, the President of Mannington, and you've been watching Kempar and Floridelli.net.